everybody. So today is a very exciting video, at least it is for me, because I finally got my Glossier package. Y'all, I have been waiting on this package for actually ever. Um, Glossier, if you're watching this, sponsor me, but also please fix your shipping because I literally ordered this October 16th and it's November 3rd and I just got it today. Um, and it was in like Ohio for a random like three, like two weeks. I don't really know what happened there, but regardless, it's finally here. I'm going to show you guys what I got. I've never purchased from Glossier before, um, but I was like, you know what, finally going to treat myself to some Glossier. So here we are. I'm excited because I don't really wear that much makeup. I'm a big fan of like natural makeup, enhancing your natural features, that kind of thing. And if you guys can see, I have a lot of freckles. So yeah, obviously I don't want to wear super cakey foundation and cover that up even though foundation is great sometimes you want that full coverage but i do not and i also don't really wear makeup every day but like glossy just seems like the perfect kind of makeup for me i know they have had some scandals with like bad color selection but i didn't purchase any of the face makeup so well not like skin tone makeup but i definitely want to try their skincare out my roommate caroline bestie caroline hey if you're watching this she highly recommends their skincare so I definitely want to try that, but I think I'm going to wait till Black Friday until it's on a little bit of a sale because, you know, I wasn't trying to drop hundreds of dollars. Um, and I'm also in college, so I'm broke. So, that being said, let's get into the unboxing. I forgot to mention, if you or your friends or anybody wants to buy anything from Glossier, I do have a code slash link down below. If you click it, you get 10% off your order, and then I get credit in return. So, you know, if I inspire you to buy anything off this video, you should click that link because I would really appreciate it. Yeah, thank you. Getting out the scissors. We're gonna cut open. I'll just like film it, I guess. Okay, maybe not. Why not? Okay, opening her up, and this is what it looks like. So, the main reason that I made my order recently, um, sorry about the suitcase in the back, it's my roommate's. So, yeah, but here are the skin or makeup products that I got, but the main reason that I made this order when I did was because I saw that they dropped a sweatshirt. And if any of you know me, you know, big sweatshirt gal here. So I was like, my favorite color is pink. I love the original pink Glossier hoodie. I never purchased it, but I was like, I don't need any more pink hoodies. But I saw the green one that they came out with, the limited edition green one. I was like, I I have to get it. Mom and Dad, if you're watching this, I'm sorry about another sweatshirt, but at least I wear the heck out of them. Um, oh, guys, look at the sticker they gave me. Oh, it's so cute. I'm obsessed. Anyways, here's the box. Super cute, but it will be thrown away. Um, actually, I need to do... I need to take a picture. Hold on. Tee But let me open up the sweatshirt. Y'all, the sweatshirt feels so soft. Bye. Oh my gosh. It's so cute. Okay. Let me put it back in the bag for the thumbnail. And then I also got a sample of the perfume because Caroline also has the perfume and it smells so good. So let me just take a little picture. Where's my phone? I'm going to try the sweatshirt on, but I'll do that before I try the makeup on. We'll just do the unboxing part. So here is a little pink packaging so cute um i can't wait to use this bag with literally everything that i do in life um but yeah i only got four products because again glossier is expensive and i wasn't trying to drop my whole bag what i basically did is i got a bomb.com and then i got one of the sets because the sets are a better value than buying the things i wanted to try individually so the first thing that i got is the bomb.com so it's just like a lip balm and then I got it in birthday cake. I don't know if this is focusing or not. Sorry, my ring light's on this side, so like it's really disproportionate the light, but it's okay. In my face, not this. Okay, that's what it is. But it's so pretty. Let me use, I'm gonna use some. And this one's untinted. Um, it's a little hard to squeeze. <gasps> Y'all. That's actually so good. I consider myself to be a, a lip, lip balm connoisseur of sorts, but it's so thick, but it's so smooth, and it smells so good. Like, you know how some lip balms, like, they smell good, but they still smell like lip balmy, like petroleum jelly-ish? Not this one. This is good. I also got the lash stick. 
so it's like their mascara because I actually am in need of new mascara and I'm pretty lucky with my lashes they're pretty like naturally curled so here's what this looks like focus 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 no um love the packaging super cute I also got the boy brow because again I had my big sharpie 2016 let's darken our eyebrows fill them in brick lifestyle and I'm over that now so now that my brows have grown in a little more I like the shape that they are but I thought the tinted boy brow would be really good to use on my brows so I got that to try and then the last thing that I got was the cloud paint so I got it in haze and I'm not much of a blush person especially because like when I get hot I naturally get a little red you can't really tell right now but I get a little flush naturally so I was like eh but it came a part of the set and I could definitely use it so I thought why not try one of the famous cloud paints so did I say cloud paint or did I say boy brow I think I said the wrong thing before but it's fine what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna put the sweatshirt on because you know you gotta feel the vibe and then we're gonna try out the makeup products so I'm excited okay I'm gonna show you guys <laughs> this is a hot mess I'm gonna show you oh my god I'm gonna show you how the hoodie fits um let's see if we can like get some light in here okay I love how it fits it's so comfy I rolled it under so it's like loose but like y'all I'm like 5'8 it's super long super big and super cozy I have long arms and like it's just so cute and I just love like the rolled over look like this with some sweatpants would be super cute I'm obsessed with it and then it says glossier right here ah, it's so cute y'all this hoodie feels so nice it's literally so soft oh my gosh it definitely feels like it was worth the money because i will say it wasn't the cheapest hoodie um but it's so soft and i'm not mad at my purchase at all not mad at all okay let me see if i can fix this lighting because i look orange and that's just not correct oh wow i wish i would have done this one first okay well it's fine, sorry about the lighting chain. Okay, there's a hair in my face. This is not, I'm not doing well right now. So I have a little mirror here. Oh, there you are, hey. Um, oh, it's dirty. So I'm gonna try first, I tried the bomb.com. Um, one of the best lip balms I've ever purchased. I will be buying more. My lips look so, just like, me look at myself love you better okay so i'm gonna do the boy brow first just because i feel like i always start with brows when i do my makeup here again is another look at it and then when i open her up this is what it looks like i got the brown one because i felt like the black was doing a little bit too much also if you like my nails i did them myself you should watch the video i posted last week on how to do them at home because your girl is broke so okay is this good okay yeah so gonna just paint her on the brow gel I usually use is like the NYX one because I've heard the NYX one was a dupe for this one um thought so far I really like it it reminds me a lot of the NYX one that I have um yeah and like I have to keep in mind the whole point of Glossier is to be like natural and like your features but better but here let's see so this is the one with the boy brow on it and this is the one with nothing um i really like the way it looks honestly like it just like puts shape in them fills them in a little bit but it's so natural i really like this stuff will i say i would repurchase it probably not because it is 16 dollars, but it is very good it reminds me actually a lot of my nyx brow pomade that I have so or brow gel sorry not pomade um yeah so I'll probably buy the NYX one again just because it's a little bit cheaper but this one is really nice okay so next what I'm gonna do is the cloud paint now, I've heard that you only need a little bit like a little bit goes a long way um here's another close-up of it here it is and then I got it in Jade Haze so I'm gonna try to take like the tiniest drop and see let's take off the little metal seal on it because this stuff a little goes a long way and I got a purpley shade because I don't really have any like purple blushes I'm gonna put a little bit 
on the back of my hand. Oh, that was a lot, that was a lot, that was a lot. Okay, well I'm not gonna use that much. I'm gonna use my finger to apply it. Um, just cause I don't wanna stain any of my brushes. I have my mirror right here, so. I'm gonna do a little on my nose too. Oh gosh, y'all, I feel like this is way too much. Don't make fun of me problem applying it. Actually, I'm gonna like face my ring light so it's even on my face. Before I like mess something up. I shouldn't have put it that like on my nose. Okay. It's cute. I like it. I might look a little sunburnt for a hot second, but you know. It's okay. I also don't have any face makeup on or anything. I just literally wanted to just see what these products are like on their own. So so far, it's really cute. It's weird seeing myself with blush on. Sorry, there's a plane outside. My window's open because it's hot. Um, I'm gonna put a little bit more on my cheeks. Just to like, I kind of like the blush on my nose though. It's kind of cute. It's kind of a cute look. I'm trying to do it up to me. Okay, I can't tell if it looks bad or not. I'm just not used to myself like with blush on my face. I mean, I think it's cute. Yeah. I mean, it's a cute little moment. You can't even really tell on camera. But I like that though because that means it's natural looking and like just like a natural little flush. Me trying to like pose? No. Like it just looks natural. I really appreciate that. I mean, as I said again, I wasn't too interested in getting the um, cloud paint, but I got it because it was part of a set. So it's cute. I like it. Um, yeah. Would I buy another one of those? I mean, I'm not really a blush person, so maybe not, but I really like the way it makes my skin look. You can't really tell on the viewfinder, but yeah, really cute. I like it. And now I'm going to try the last thing I got, which is the lash stick. We'll focus. We'll focus. Lash stick. And let's just unbox her. And I'm a big mascara fan. Um, Pick one makeup item you can't live without. For me, it would definitely be mascara because mascara has the power to make me look from a zombie to like wide awake, ready for the world, ready to take on the day. So I'm excited to try this out. Ooh, I really like how it separates my lashes, but it looks so natural. Oh, guys, this is good. Oh my gosh, wait, y'all. <gasps> Okay, the difference, okay, let me see if you can even freaking see this. So like, look, mascara, no mascara, but like, can y'all tell the difference? I got some on my eyelids, so it kind of, oh, and it dries pretty, oh my gosh. This might be my new favorite mascara, like dead serious. Um, that's just the top coat, just on the top lash, and let's do the bottom lash. And see, okay, you can see the blush a little more. Um, I just love how it like darkens my lashes. Okay, here's the finished eye. Um, yeah, just super natural looking mascara. But like, see y'all, see with mascara without, I look, I look alive. She's alive. Okay, y'all. So we're gonna do final thoughts really quick. Final thoughts. I added some highlight and some powder to my face just for some contrast, but overall, I'm really pleased with how all the products turned out. Okay, so, my camera literally almost just broke. I would definitely repurchase the mascara, and I definitely want to get more bomb.coms for sure, for sure. These were pretty much worth the hype. I think they are hyped up for a reason because they're really good. Definitely, if you have the chance to try these, I would because I'm really happy with the results. The mascara, super natural looking, but like it still like defines and like separates your lashes in a really nice way. And I also feel like it lengthened my lashes a lot, which is really good. And then the bomb.com, probably one of the best lip balms I've ever tried. And I've tried a lot of lip balms. Definitely want to get more flavors and try some of the tinted ones, see how I like those. Other two things that I got, the Boy Brow and the Cloud Paint, I think they're really good. However, I've used products similar to this that I think 
you could just get the other ones instead of spending the extra money on the brand but I mean if you like packaging this packaging is adorable super cute and I mean I'm glad I have these in my collection I definitely will be using them I just have stuff like this in my makeup collection that I don't really see the point of like spending the extra money on these ones per se and then finally the hoodie 10 out of 10 on the hoodie so comfortable so soft such high quality um yeah don't regret anything that I bought though I'm glad I finally got to try Glossier I have been wanting to try their stuff for literally years like years and I was watching a lot of these like Glossier try-on videos and like unboxings and like first time using them and a lot of people like aren't doing them anymore so a lot of people were saying that Glossier is kind of like dying out but I don't think it's dying now I just think you know a lot of brands since Glossier has been launched have made products like Glossier and obviously drugstore products that you just go to the store and get are more accessible than ordering this stuff online but yeah I'm just excited that I finally got to try out this brand I'm gonna end the video here though because I feel like there's nothing else to say um, I definitely will be getting more products from them for either Black Friday or for Christmas so you definitely do see me do another Glossier type video maybe their skincare next or maybe I'll try their like face makeup and we could do like a full face kind of moment but I think the products I have here are perfect for me and what I use on a daily basis like I could see myself doing all four of these steps every day just because I feel like it's just cute like it's a cute little look but yeah comment down below if you've ever tried Glossier before and what products you like which ones you think I should try what shades you think I should try because I would love to know and yeah Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I need to blow out my candle before my RA comes because we're not supposed to have those. <laughs> and yeah, have a great rest of your night and day. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe so I can quit my job and do YouTube full time. Yeah, thank you for watching.